Hello, this is Russ Walden with Father's Heart Ministry. Welcome to the Daily Prophetic Word. The Father says today, don't let the words of those who prophesy doom and gloom to cause your resolve to waver. The doom and gloomers have seen some things. They speak hastily about matters they neither understand nor consider in the light of my finished work at the cross. I spoke through the prophet Joel of both darkness and morning, gross darkness, yet as morning spread on the mountains in the same season. So you can be a gross darkness and doom and gloomer, or you can be uh, one who focuses and gets out of bed on the morning side of my glory. The darkness is not, you have no reservation. I canceled your reservation in darkness. The darkness is reserved for my adversaries. Yet there is a brilliant dawn for you because I am the day star arising in your heart. Arise and shine for my glory is come upon you. And this day, my glory illuminates those spheres of influence where I am placing you. This world, this cosmos will be shaken, yet I will arise in my people and cause you to stand firm in unshakable dominion. Will you partner with me in establishing my kingdom of love, my kingdom of righteousness, and my kingdom of life and life more abundantly? As you navigate through tumultuous times, it's important to remember the power of partnership with me through faith in the establishment of my kingdom upon the earth. This partnership calls upon you to stand firm in the face of adversity, to be the one left standing when everybody else fled, they cut and run. Trust in my promises, says the Father. Trust in my steadfast love. I'm calling you to walk in the light of my glory by allowing my presence to shine through you and to impact the world around you. It is ever crucial in this season to discern the voices that speak into your life. There are times your counselors, the worth of your counselor is only in terms of that which they can impart to you. They can't give you what they don't have. So be wary of those who only prophesy doom and gloom. While it is important, yes, to identify we have an enemy, there are dark forces at work in the world, but you're not of this world. You are seated in heavenly places with me. You must hold on to the hope in your relationships, in your spiritual walk, in your faith, in your finances, in your physical health, in the hope and assurance found in my word. My promises of a brilliant dawn and unshakable dominion remind you that I am in control of your situation and will ultimately manifest my triumph over all the evil encroaching against you. In partnering with me, you are called to be an agent of love, an agent of righteousness and entitlement according to the shed blood of Calvary, of abundant life in a world that desperately needs healing and restoration. This means actively engaging with those around you in my name, showing compassion and mercy, and standing up for justice and righteousness. It can be daunting, but one that is made, this stand is made possible, how? Through alignment with my spirit and reliance on my strength. So will you heed the call to partner with me, says God, in establishing my kingdom on this earth and in that jurisdiction that I have stamped with your accountability and your assignment? Will you rise up with courage and with faith, knowing that my glory is illuminating the darkness and bringing about a new dawn of hope and redemption. The choice is yours, but the opportunity to be a part of something greater than yourself 
It's a privilege not to be taken lightly. Choose, says God, to embrace this calling with boldness and determination, knowing that I'm with you every step of the way. Does this word resonate with you? Listen, mix this word with some faith. How? By sowing into its fulfillment in your life. Why? Listen, the faith that it takes to give into a prophetic word is equivalent to the faith involved in bringing that very word to pass in your situation. Timing is important. Listen, act now because your response time to God is a metric for God's response to you bringing this very word to pass in your life. This is Russ Walden with Father's Heart Ministry. Go to www.fathersheartministry.net. Click on the donation link and let your faith soar. Act now. And remember, the sky isn't falling. The kingdom is coming. God bless you.